The Prince Rupert Port Authority hosted trade talks last week, which gave insight into the Canada Border Services Agency operations at Prince Rupert's Container Port. What we're looking for in particular is anything that would be considered a danger to people or a danger to trade chains. The idea is that if we can identify a container that's a risk before uh, it even is loaded, we can then isolate it and keep it at that foreign port and it'll never even make the journey. The event touched on how the agency screens containers before and after they leave Prince Rupert, reviewing pieces of equipment officers use and what they're used for. And this is what they look like inside of the container. It's a picture of the container number. It shows you your outside surroundings. They'll actually examine... While virtually all the traffic is legitimate, CBSA officers in Prince Rupert have spotted some illegal cargo over the years. Uh, we have had uh, some uh, precursor chemicals chemicals which are controlled usually, but they're also used to make maybe more serious drugs. So, uh, for example, uh, GBL is a, it's like a liquid chemical that is used to create GHB, which is the date rate drug. Um, some of the other chemicals we found are precursors for ecstasy, methamphetamine. <coughs> um, so it is for the northernview.com, I'm Martina Perry. So